Hey everybody, John Ricky, how you doing? I just got done from a great event. My good friend, his wife, he and she will have a tw twins. Isn't that awesome? Um, yeah, I mean, you know, time goes on. We're getting older. I saw a lot of friends from my past. I mean, some of these guys we've been together Gee, for 20 years um, and then I have my childhood friends that we've been since you know kids and the interesting thing is we get older but our soul our personality the core of it stays the same it's really interesting and I want us to understand that because you know I'm not a parent right now but there, I know some of my age group that are parents and we we may put a lot of pressure like we had pressure on our cells from our parents and there's a high expectation but i want all of us to take a look at ourselves and remember that that young person in us who's still alive by the way um how we went through those struggles and those challenges and right now we're still going through struggles and challenges but to have empathy for the child right now or the teenager or the 20 year old right now that's going through these challenges I think I think every generation has a higher expectation of the younger generation but we got to give them that that chance that flexibility to give it their best shot likewise we're still doing it right now our generation my generation the generation above the baby boomers and the last of the World War II generation most of the World War II is retired. In fact, they're all gone. All, most of them out of the the leadership positions and and the the, the working positions. The baby boomers are, are leaving. Gen my generation X, you know, we we're we're still here. Some of us on the younger side is still trying to trying to make our biggest moves. You know, forties, fifties. That's where it's at, right? Thirties too. Um, but in time. You look at 20s and what we saw 20s as before, totally different, right? When we're 18, 15, 14, looking at 40, we're like, whoa, 50, whoa. But now you think about it, man, that, that time flies. So it's valuable. Everything's valuable. Every moment is valuable. Everything you decide on right now will connect to tomorrow. You know, Everyone has priorities and I'm a little bit crazy, but my priorities have always been on my vision of what I want for the greater, what I enjoy doing, my family, my friends, my loved ones, but everything else really falls down. I mean, I know guys who clean up their house every single day, maybe twice a day, I don't know, but I would rather put it into my work. Because those hours will compound over time. You, you know, that's me. That's me. But that's what I do. Everything I do, I'm like obsessed. But everything else falters. I mean, that's the only way. So for me, that's the only way because time is, there's only so much time. There's only so much time we can do this. And for those of you who are writers, I mean, you know how many hours, hundreds of hours, thousands of hours you put in to get one story out. And I think a lot of people don't, really understand that just like a lawyer drafting contracts i don't think a lot of people understand the details and the intricacies and the thought and the creativity that goes involved with drafting a contract as well as a novel or a screenplay or a movie or creating all of that but our goal is to get that product done and if we don't put that day-to-day -day effort and that learning it, it it will not happen especially um projects that are huge audacious we just gotta give it a try and that's what i'm trying to tell you right now so i wish you the best keep going all out and spread love spread love around the world love you guys take care bye